Hi everybody, this is Deb from D&D Art Gallery. Today I have a 12 by 12 uh, canvas that I'm going to do a traveling uh, pour on and uh, traveling cup pour. I haven't done one of these in a while and I, and I really have a lot of fun with them. I enjoy doing them. I think they're simple and normally they come out with pretty good results. So I'm going to give it a try. I do have a coat of the Artist Loft Low Acrylic White all over my canvas here. And let's go over my colors. My first color is Deco Art Extreme Sheen Sapphire. My next color is Deco Art uh, Metallic Berry. The next color is Folk Art Color Shift Aqua Flash Turquoise Brilliant. That's a real pretty color. And the next color is a combination. I wanted to use silver, and I started out with the Deco Art Extreme Sheen Silver, but ran out, so I added some Folk Art Silver Sterling to that. So it's a combination of, of those two there. And my last color is the Artist Flow Acrylic White, but I added a little dab of, it's called Handmade Modern. It's a paint from our Target store. A department store here it's called shimmer egg and it's just got a little shimmer to it so I added that to some of the white that I'm going to be putting in the cup in the traveling cup um, pouring medium today is simple it's two parts Floetrol um, one part paint half a part of Liquitex gloss medium and varnish and a squirt of Gek 800 was added to all my paints no silicone added so let's get started today i think i'll put my cup right up here and i'm going to just put some of the artist flow acrylic white in and around that cup hopefully get it going here and i have a lot of shimmery blinging colors going on here today so let's see what we get Like I said, I haven't done one of these in a long, long time. Hopefully that cup will start moving on its own. And if not, I'll have to give it a little nudge. I've had to do that before. Looks like it's starting to take off here. And what I'm going to do is just turn that, see if I can get it to come the other way. And I'm going to help it along here a little bit. And I may even tip a little bit here. See if I can get it to move. Here's that shimmery white that I made up. Put a little bit more white here to help it along. This sapphire, the deco art, is very, very pretty.
We could have plenty of paint here too. been watching a lot of um, art videos but I really haven't seen many of these done lately either curious to see how the color shift is going to turn out in this Okay, I think I'm going to just turn it again. Okay, getting down to the bottom of my paints here now. Okay, I'm going to turn it again till I finish my paints up here. They're almost finished. Just a dab here and a dab there, and we are done. And I'm going to finish with this white. Okay. And I'm just going to help it along here a little bit at the end. Okay. I'm 
I'm going to torch. And I'm going to tip. Looks very interesting, doesn't it? I'm not sure that I like that, um, the white streak in the middle. So I think what I will do is take one of my sticks here and see if I can do something about that before I keep tipping. Spread it out a little bit. A lot of interesting little cells here. Just going to get down over this corner. And bring it back. It has a very soft palette look to it here today. Get down this far corner here. And I'm going to bring it back. Just bringing, bringing it down here to this, this corner here. Just stretching it a little bit here. And then bringing it back. And I'm gonna take a look at it. This looks like a very, very cloudy look painting. I'm very happy with it. It's very shimmery. The color palette is very accommodating to one another, I would say. The pinks are beautiful in there. The turquoise green. That sapphire, very pretty. Just looking at the composition here and seeing if there's anything I want to change. Maybe just a little bit tip this way yet. And bring it back. Whoops. Oh, shoot. Well, I'm going to have to fix that. That's what happens. I'll tip that and tip that right off. See if we can get something good to look up there. Okay. Just slipped a little bit out of my hands there. But let's take a look at it now. That's very pretty. Very, very pretty. I'm going to wipe my hands off here again before I pick it up. It's 
I do like these streaks in here, very pretty. In the pink, so muted, so beautiful. Sapphire, very shiny. I think I'll clean off the bottom here. Check my corners. See if they need any help. I'm lucky I had enough paint left on my canvas to do a little more tipping there. When I had that mistake of putting my fingers in it. I'm going to give it another torch here. See if we bring up anything else. Pretty happy with this. Anything, I think I just tip a little bit down this way. Just to this corner, just a little bit. And then bring it back. Pretty happy with that. Very nice. I will turn it for you though. I think the composition of it should go this way. And I will get you down for a close up. You can tell me what you think. Again, this is a 12 by 12 inch canvas that I did a traveling uh, cup pour on. And this is the upper left-hand corner. Very shimmery, very shiny. Little red cells popping up there. Very pretty in here. A little bit of purple down here. That's the lower left-hand corner. And I will take you up the middle. Really pretty in here with that white streak and I even got a little bit of lacing there. Some blue cells that came up. Very busy in here. Very pretty in here. And this is the upper right hand corner. It's probably one of my favorite spots right here. That's a beautiful color right there, that turquoise color. And the muted pinks here, beautiful. Just that's a very nice area there. And here's the lower right hand corner. So let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video and share it. Make sure you ring the bell. Choose all so you'll know the next time that I do post a new video. Make sure and leave a comment if there's something I could improve on. 
um, something you'd like to see me pour, I'd be more than happy to do that. I'm always looking for suggestions on how to improve and um, what you'd like to see done. If you have watched my past videos and, and have liked a certain pour that I did and would like to see it again, just let me know. And until next time, take care, everybody. Bye for now.